สบายดี I'm s a i จุมริบสุบัด I am Amrit We are, are Vaisili fellows from Laos and Cambodia It is an honor for us to be fellows in the Vaisili program to study in the USA in the ASU uh, As you have been here for four weeks, we have something to tell you Would you like to talk about the academic stuff, something that we learned? Yeah. So we have done so many things. We have learned a lot, and we have visited so many places. The first part that we would like to highlight is academic classes that we've taken. One of them is understanding yourself mm -hmm. from a leadership point of view. So according to the class conducted by Dr. Christine b u z i n d i character, strength, and values are very important for leader for their self-development and their personal growth as well. What do you think, Sai? Oh yes, yeah, I totally agree with you. It's very important for us to understand ourselves in order to effectively collaborate with others, as we hope others to understand themselves as well. We hope everyone to understand where we are, who we are, where we are going, so we can align each other. Yes. Apart from that, I, yeah, we learned something as well. Of course, another course that. Really interesting to us is po building positive use development. Yes. According to uh, development work uh, theories, it is very important to look at the community. But some development workers may go there based on by looking at the problems or potential of the community. So it's very important of how to approach uh, youth development in certain community in a certain ways. How about you? Yeah, uh, it's very important because, especially for us, we are working for with youth. It's important to look at the potential rather than looking their bad sign, negative sign. So we we don't have to look down at them. We want to build them. We want to empower them so they can out empower our next generation as well. We learn a lot in classes, but also we visited many places. One of them we did go is the refugee organization that is operating in Arizona. What do you think about that? Well, okay. Uh, back to my country, we don't really have in Laos. We don't have the refugees. I would say I have uh, zero knowledge about the refugees. When I was there, I learned a lot. What are they? What are those people? What they have to structure? What they have to do? To set, resettle their life here, it is very hard. But it is good for us to understand those people why we should accept them. And I totally, uh, I really want to say that USA is doing a great job, doing a very good example of dealing with those refugees. How about you? Yeah, I think it's very important to give refugee a stable life. So this organization has been providing a lot of support in terms of education, employment, and other opportunity compared to uh, normal U.S. citizens. Another organization that we visited yeah. is called Local First Arizona, <laughs> which is an organization that strives not only to connect all business network in Arizona to promote economic prosperity in Phoenix and Arizona as a whole, but also try to engage like local Ari. z o n a people, how they can consume or how they can contribute by building local uh, Arizona brand and promoting uh, local business as well. Yeah. What do, For me, what I think about is uh, we can apply this back to our communities. We are, how to say, the no me. Some of the places are empty. It is they have been. They did a good job on bringing people together by gathering those local business to create the event there, so they can attract people. People have uh, activities to do there. That's the one way, effective way to make people feel connected in that areas, so that area could be developed faster. In addition to classes and site visit, we also help contribute to American society. We did a lot of community services. One of them that I find very interesting is feeding starving children. So basically, we together try to pack food in a comp and like a competition. So we enjoy a lot of fun. We enjoy a lot of uh, joyful. Uh, A time together. At the same time, we try to finish our packing process in order to be de delivered to other children across the world. 
Okay, for me, uh, apart from understanding and seeing that there are many people that need help from us, from communities to really contribute something to them so they can survive even a day back to our countries. I know that people want to do this, but however, we don't really know how, uh, how to deal with those obstacles while we have to do the projects like gaining budgets or doing the implementation uh, process or something. But yeah, it is a very good example for us to teach us that it is not that hard if we want to do something. And this activity has been a very good example for us. Apart from that, we also, of course, we also visited another place uh, that help providing shelter to homeless in general. So basically, they provide shelter and employment services to American uh, homeless people so that they can have a better uh, and more stable life and uh, can go back and uh, survive on their own without support. Yeah, and that what we did from that that taught us a lot on how can we work in team. We were separated in many groups, and then we have the, our own roles, and we have to finish it as in time that we are given. It's very good for us as the youth reader. They have they need to have in their life. Okay, uh, how about the tourist aspects then? All right, so many places that I've visited on the weekend while studying on the weekdays. And one of the places that we visited is Grand Canyon, and I find it very amazing. Grand Canyon does not only showcase its historical and cultural significance to the world, but also kind of boosts a lot of tourist potential in the local area, especially in Arizona. A part of learning the leadership skills, we also travel, as you say, that I learned something from this as a uh, American, they have done a great job on protecting, preserving those areas, especially the way how they deal with tourism is, how to say, it's very good. I mean, they can, all of the process is to protect those environment as well as we are trying to ex experience them. And it is a good case that can generous, generate the incomes to the local communities as well. Yeah. And another place that we will miss the most after the program is ASU campus. It's such a beautiful campus with all many students from various countries and we enjoy the school has been, that the school has been provided us in terms of facility and other uh, opportunity uh, around campus. Thank you for leading us here to ASU. Uh, the SU give me the views of the diversity of the students and give me the views how can I be better prepared in order to study in abroad as the student from a developing country like us. It is very important to be prepared than to just go and study there. Okay. All right, so we have enjoyed a lot. This has been a wonderful five weeks experience in the United States and I believe that Vicely Academic Fellowship is the platform that help build young potential leaders and also bridge mutual uh, understanding from various nations uh, regardless, uh, uh, regardless of their sex, uh, race, language, cultures to come together and jointly address global issue. And I believe that this incredible journey will endeavor, will uh, pursue its endeavor in the pursuit of uh, promoting uh, its own causes. And may I say that uh, I've been uh, extremely fortunate of being selected in this program to learn about our American cultures and to learn about the leadership skills all the relations that I don't think that I can uh, experience anywhere else. Yeah. We would like to show our appreciation and thanks to all program staff that help us, assist us to uh, enjoy this wonderful experience. Uh, thank you for bringing us together. Some of us are different, but we have the visions and missions to make this world become a better place to live. Thank you.
चाहिए